Boy Dale Glen Boy, good morning. It's Friday again and a special time of the week when we celebrate all the fantastic learning you've been sending to your teachers. And I've been absolutely astounded this week with some of the fantastic videos your teachers have sent me to have a look at. So die down, pal, that's fantastic. And next week, do you know you have a week off? from your home learning because it's half term and I know just before the end of every half term I always tell you don't I to keep yourself safe in the holidays but this year it's more important than ever that you stay at home and you keep yourself safe now to keep you entertained during half term Glen Boy has got a special challenge for you so keep your eyes peeled later on today for a special video showing you what we'd like you to do next week when you're not in school and you're not doing any home learning. Now then, let's see who your teachers have got as their stars of the week this week. Bye everybody, hoya bao, have a lovely week off. Hi nursery, it's star of the week time again and this week I have got no doubt in my mind who star of the week can be. Now this person, when I spoke to their mama first, I think they found her a bit strange doing work for their mommy and daddy at home and not doing work with me and Miss Thomas. But the last couple of weeks, he has just been on a roll, okay? He's been doing absolutely amazing writing, his shapes, he sang me a song, it's just amazing. So my star of the week is Frankie. So well done, Frank. Now the rest of you, if you want to be my star of the week, you've got to send me in some work, okay? So after half term now, let's see what you can all do, okay? Bye guys, have a nice half term. Our pal. No, it's not a spy. It's me, Miss Bundy. I'm just outside giving my plants some uh, water because it's bite down at the moment. I hope you're all staying safe in the sun, putting on lots of sun cream. Um, and here is Star of the Week again. And this week I've got two Stars of the Week and they're both little girls. So my first Star of the Week is Kinsey for her super ordering and counting to 20. She middled up all the cards her mammy did and then Kinsey ordered them. And she was really confident to doing that. So Diane Kinsey. And my second star of the week is for Sophie and special mention to her sister Lydia. They did a fabulous sink and float show where they were both scientists and they were making a show to show which objects were sinking and floating. Bendy Gerdig. I'd also like to give a mention to Harrison because Miss Bundy went on a walk and found some tadpoles and it wasn't part of their home learning but I just said if you could find out about the life cycle of a tadpole if you want to and Harrison did it straight away and he was so passionate about it so Diane Harrison too. I hope you're all staying safe. Miss you. Welcome to my Sink and Float show. This is my sister Lydia. This is my drink of water. This is my pudding. No, I like those. First is the car. We think it's going to flip. Glen Boy, Miss Nixon's favourite day of the week again. It's Friday um, and the sun is shining and we're ready for a week of half two. So Miss Nixon has had to pick a star of the week this week for class two. Um, again, a really tricky job. The learning coming in is amazing. But this week, my star of the week goes to a little boy in year two 
who has written a fantastic diary entry um, from the main character in our story called Stanley and I am just so so proud of the standard of his writing and the presentation of his work this week and my star of the week this week goes to Kobe so Diane Kobe keep up the amazing learning I hope you all have the most amazing half term enjoy the sunshine make lots and lots of memories and hopefully we'll see each other again soon bye Pope. Happy Friday! I hope you've all been enjoying this beautiful sunny weather we've been having and lots of you are playing in your gardens or going on nice once or twice a day walk. It's been really lovely here as well and I've certainly been enjoying the sunshine. Wow, I can't believe it's another Friday already. What amazing work I've had in this week. We've been doing rewriting lyrics to Food Glorious Food and I've heard some fantastic changes to that song. But two people this week have really, really impressed me. Not only on the hard work that they've been doing, but also the teamwork that they've been having and how much they've been helping each other. Miley and Ava, you two are my stars of the week this week because I've been so impressed with how much learning you've said in and the fact that you've been talking to each other and helping with e each other with your work it's really lovely to see okay that's all from me for now see you next time bye blown away by your work this week. That Welsh is amazing Gracie. That maths as well boys. Kaya Caden. Fantastic. But then Ellis. Wow. Science experiment. You're my star of the week. You are. That was brilliant. That was. Your prediction. Your conclusion. Amazing. I hope you're all doing really well. Keep yourself safe and I'll see you all soon. Bye bye. everybody good morning happy friday this week we've had lots of lovely learning yet again but my son right now goes to livy she's been uploading daily she's been helping her brother out and i've had a lovely story off it so i am bendy gay dig interview with my character my name is lily my name does have a meaning because my, my mother's favorite flower is a lily my dad chose my name because because sadly, when I was born, my mother passed. My mother passed away. Um, my current job is working in Starbucks. I'm feeling great because me, my dad, and my big brother are going to the beach. I have blue eyes, as blue as the sky. Darglen boy, now it's the time. Who's the star of the week? So, which class has won our £10 for their class? Which class has done the most online learning and has been in touch with their teacher and has been trying their hardest? This is when I should have a drum roll, a but I haven't got a drum roll, so I'll just do this. Doesn't sound like a drum roll. Are you ready? 50% of this class have been doing amazing work for Miss Harding. So it's class five, third time in a row. So yay! 